Today we are going to discuss about how to create an application in ASP.NET Razor MVC. So let's start with one example here. This is my VC Studio as you can see. For creating a new web application in MVC, go to File, click on New, New Project. Instead of Web, you have to select ASP.NET MVC 4 and give a good name. Here it is Demo, App, Test. Click OK button. Now a new window will come. As you can see, there are so many options. Empty, Basic, Internet, Intranet, Mobile Application, Web API. Here I am going to select Empty Web Application using Razor Engine. If you want unit test project to be appended with this solution, you have to check Create a unit test project and then click OK button. This will add a empty ASP.NET MVC project in Razor Engine. As you can see, my new ASP.NET MVC project have been added with unit test cases. So you can see the solution is ready now. It has mainly three parts, controller, model and views. First of all, we need to create one controller. From controller, we have to call one action result or any action which will invoke the view. Let's start with controller. Right click on the control folder and select add, add controller. A new dialog will come. Here you have to specify the name of the controller. Here I am going to specify home controller. Now there are templates that MVC will do for you. Here I am going to select one empty MVC controller and click add button. This will create the first controller that is home controller for you in save controller folders. In save home controller you can see there is one action results named index. We want to create one view for this index action result. For that right click in save this method and select add view. This will open a new dialog as you can see. We can provide the name of the view in the view name section. Here I am providing it as index. Second, if you want the Razor Engine or ASPX Engine, we can select it from View Engine. Here I am selecting as a Razor Engine. If you need any kind of strongly typed view, you have to select the class from the model class. For that, you need to check the checkbox, create a strongly typed view and select from the model class drop down list. If you need to create a partial view, you need to select create as a partial view checkbox. Else, if you need any kind of layout or master page, you need to check the use a layout or master page checkbox and select from the browse button. Finally, for adding the view, you need to click the add button. I have added right now. Yes. The view is added as you can see inside views folder a folder with the controller name home inside that the view named index is added index.cshtml if you double click on that you can see it is open right now we are almost done here now we need to add some html part inside index.cshtml here i'm adding welcome to technomark.in Now let's run this application. For running this application, we have to invoke the home controller and then the action name. Here it is index. Let's run this application. Yes, you can see the web page is opened. Welcome to Technomark.in. By this way, we can create an application using S.MVC with Razor Engine. Thank you guys for watching this video. Please visit 
Take them up, Dorton, for more information.